morning's duty for me and Becca. Man, it was straight. We actually ran out of ammo. <laughs> we actually went out here to scout this morning and found a spot just loaded with doves. And uh, we actually ran out of ammo. We only, we only had a few boxes with us, and that went pretty quick. Look at that. Ugh. Eurasian collared dove. Well, I got my limit. 15 doves, man. Big number 15. So, and cleaned up the area. Picked up a lot of shells today. And that's what a limit of doves look like right there. Bye. -bye.
Um, you, if you saw my July hunt camp meal, California had record heat waves and record droughts this summer. And I really wasn't optimistic at how well the uh, chucker and some of the quail were going to uh, survive through that summer. And uh, all the vegetation around here, you know, middle of November, it should be green right now. And everything is just dead or dying. So in addition to water problems, they probably also have food source issues. So I'm not sure how well the, uh, the chucker did this year, but uh, the outlook looks pretty bleak to me. up there no. oh. time to uh, get the hunting gear on
have uh, the dove meat. It's been cooking in the crock pot for four hours. Oh my God, it smells delicious. Then uh, homemade tortillas. That's right. My wife makes her own tortillas. Really can't wait to dig into those. Nothing like a fresh homemade tortilla. Then uh, some homemade pico de gallo. Fresh vegetables from the garden. Some delicious Spanish rice. And we're ready to eat some tacos over here. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, Dove Tacos. Becca's specialty right here. Slow cooked for four hours. Fresh Spanish. So Becca's been slow cooking this pheasant pot pie soup in the crock pot for eight hours. Oh, man, doesn't that look delicious? Look at those chunks of pheasant. Can't wait to dig into this.